Speaking on Nick Ferrari's LBC show, arch Brexiteer Jacob Rees-Mogg defended the UK's colonial past saying that it was not wholly a bad thing and cited examples such as the abolition of the slave trade. He noted too that there were blots on the UK's colonial history. Mr. Rees-Mogg made the comments as Mr. Ferrari questioned him on Jeremy Corbyn's plans to teach the history of slavery and colonialism more thoroughly in schools. Mr. Rees-Mogg said, the British Empire had good and bad bits like all sorts of things, the bad bits were terrible, but some of its good bits were really wonderful, the ending of the slave trade was a remarkable success, he continued, think of the death of Gordon at Khartoum, one of the reasons he was at Khartoum was he was trying to stop the slave trade that was going on in Sudan at that point. Jacob Rees-Mogg said British colonialism has good bits and blots, image, Getty LBC, there were noble figures, there were honorable figures, and there were rogues, we did great things in the British Empire, but there are blots on it as well, that's true of all countries at all times, not just those who have empires. But also what goes on at home, there are things that have happened in the UK over the last hundred years that looking back on it, people are deeply ashamed. Jeremy Corbyn sparked outrage among Tory politicians as he said, School children should be taught about the grave injustices of the British Empire. The Labour leader is to announce plans for a major reform of the teaching of history in school in a speech he will deliver in Bristol on Thursday. There, Mr. Corbyn will argue black British history and the history of the British Empire, colonialism and slavery should be taught more extensively in school, to help ensure their legacy is more widely understood across the country. He will say, it is vital that future generations understand the role that black Britons have played in our country's history in the struggle for racial equality. In the light of the Windrush scandal, Black History Month has taken on a renewed significance and it is more important now than ever that we learn and understand as a society the role and legacy of the British Empire, colonization and slavery. Black History Month is a crucial chance to celebrate the immense contribution of black Britons to this country, to reflect on our common history and ensure that such grave injustices can never happen again. Despite the speech is yet to be delivered, the quotes released have already fueled the outrage of members of the Conservative Party, who accused Mr. Corbyn of being ashamed of his own country.